Hello everyone, this is Strawberry Sorty back with Trapped Girls. Oh my gosh. I still don't know that we can save. This game is just really good about not reloading, so what you have to do is turn all the power related stuff off. So we gotta turn all these lamps off. I still don't know what the lamps do. I think we're going the wrong way. I always forget where the frick that other lamp is. Is that all of them? Nope. Yeah, we still got the ones on the first floor. Missing something. What are we missing? Turn the lamps off. Unless we missed a lamp. I don't know how she's apparently still alive. Unless we've already turned off enough and don't need to do anymore. we can put the battery back. We'll just have to see if it works. No, what do we forget to turn off? Can't be the heater. Electricity there. All I can think of is the other tower. That was the window, not a drawbridge. Can we do anything with this here? Nope. Turning everything off is supposed to make this react, but for some reason it's not. Okay, I finally figured out that I had to turn the projector off. Well, I wasn't really planning to rescue her, but whatever. Why is that girl gray? I guess we just haven't seen her yet. Where am I going? Did we not get those back?
Is there a single looking flower thingy there? The two girls we saved and the one we still haven't found. Look at them forceps again. Oh, put these back. I think we won't need these for the ending or gear and awards. Of course, now I'm lost. I was not expecting the wire cutters to vanish. Okay, I remembered. We have this girl now. So that should allow us to cut that. Well, we've saved everyone we're gonna save. Do we just not ever get these? Well, now we can get them. But are there any chains left to cut? I have to go the long way around. I don't know if this will trigger a rescue since we have accomplished what we can. We can do the uh, the uh, the thingies. The uh, things that require these tools. You just load it when you trigger something and you have no idea what you triggered. Okay, we get to set them. Is it supposed to be SOS we're spelling? Because I'm pretty sure we're spelling orb. Well, I think we're just supposed to do this. See if that works. Only two girls here. Surprise loud music. There are other endings which I hope have actually the stuff that happens in it. I don't think we can kill all the girls, because I think we need to 
at least have black haired girl with us. And type C. Let me check my uh, ogre D visitor E. Older, but these are weird ending names. So next up, we're killing everybody. Now we just have to find the key. <laughs> Wouldn't be here though. Wait, I remember. We just have her not hit the water at all. She just looks so sad. We're just gonna leave you there for a minute. We already killed most of the girls next to them, so I'm not sure it actually matters. I don't even know if this changes or if that's the right color scheme. Check just to make sure. Yeah, blue, yellow, pink, and green. This one. <laughs> well, there's nothing to do here yet. Can't use the forceps. Don't want to use the phone. Yeah, we should probably go get that tennis ball. this upstairs. I still don't remember how the frick we got that open last time.
also realizing I still don't know what those freaking things do. Oh, going to the wrong location again. room with a freaking mechanism in it. Believe it or not, injuring her is actually part of the good ending. Crazy as that seems. Isn't it messed up? Yeah, because there was no water, we lost. Of course, I still don't know how to make that ladder drop down. Make the ladder drop down. I don't know if we can actually kill that other one. Need to get the key. I don't know how to make her fall. Okay, so I think... Like that kind of weird there. So I don't remember what I have to do next. How we turn all the power off? 
Oh wait, don't wanna do that. Sort of the hardest part is locating these freaking lamps. Freaking lamp. That wouldn't be good. No. No. Cut that one off. There we go. Oh, still not enough. What are we missing? To turn this machine off, whatever the frick it is. Oh, it's already off. Projector's off. It's unplugged. Lamp is off. That one is on. I do you have to turn that off? The saw? Now we have to maim this girl. Which doesn't count as a death, but...
those there. Wait. Not quite sure how we kill girl dangling on ledge. We have to do something specific. <coughs> oh, well, that was easy enough. She has tentacles coming out of her. We got C again, so I must have to do something special. Okay, I had to replay. I think you have to have black haired girl alive. Okay, there we go. <laughs> That's unfortunate. I'm gonna try to film this whole school. No, black hair girl is not a good person. I'm still waiting for the story. I know there's some sort of story thing you can get, I just don't know where you get it. And type D. We're going to pause again to go for another ending because I think most of the stuff is the same. Okay, so this should be another ending, but we'll see. Oh, the zombie killed everybody. The zombie still survived. So to get that ending, it seems like we have to save the blonde girl from the eaten by the zombie. One other ending, I think that requires us to save everybody though. And type A. So, we're only missing two endings, and I believe ending B is save everyone but also the, the, the evil girl. Since we have to save everyone for both of them, 
We're gonna show how to do that now. I, I hate that it's not completely blind at this point, but you know, what can you do? I think this phone is the key to saving the girl that gets hit by the hatchet. I'm gonna mess around with that. Or that. Gonna have to be fast, but we're gonna try and save her. Well, I think this is what we need the wood for. Well, I'm gonna try again. I think we need to use the wood. Is it a rotted wood? I don't know how we'd pull that off, though. I try to figure this out. I'm not fast enough. Okay, so apparently I was doing the right thing, but let's try again. Let's see, it doesn't work. I don't know how you would do this fast enough. Okay, we're gonna try this one more time. Oh, it still won't fit. Okay, so apparently we can only use the normal wood. I guess we get it back. So do we have to use the rotted foot against the zombie? Okay, can't do anything in here yet. This is where it gets really messed up. the lamps. Let's test my phone theory. This is the only one I'm not sure about. But it's all I can think of. I don't want to put it here. sense of direction. Let's try calling her and see if that wakes her up. I don't know why we can't just drag her off the bed by force, but...
Okay, unplug this. The key. Oh, wait. Grab that. I can't do this yet. Actually, we might have to do it. It'll be really fast. So we have to get the wire cutters to get her down. Actually, that's another room away, so that should be fine. Two of these. Let's hope this one block is enough, or we'll have to restart. the recording and restart, which sucks. Shouldn't have time-sensitive things like that. Okay, we got her and managed to get both of the ice blocks. I remember to turn the power off on all this stuff. I guess this is supposed to be boiling water. Yeah, it's not boiling anymore. Okay, two lamps. Almost, almost cut her loose. We need the second floor. This is the part where it's messed up. It's okay, she's alive. Just, you know, traumatized. I guess we can get her anyway. There's no one in that bed. Here is the third floor. Second floor. Severed this poor girl's leg. Now we have to take it for puzzles. I gotta do this fast, because I'm pretty sure it's timed. Sorry, that rotted board. I don't know if it'll actually hold, but 
Our options are limited. Oh my gosh, is it not going to let us do it? Well, then I don't know what we're supposed to do. Unless it just triggers no matter what. Well, we've come this far, we might as well find out. Let's go save the evil girl. If we trigger that zombie ending again, I'm going to be so ticked. Oh, yeah, we... And then how do we free her? Because we need the wire cutters to free her, but... You have to free the other girl, because otherwise the zombie will eat the leg. Oh, because we can't do that. We need... Unless we can do both. It's getting on my last nerve. No. Oh my gosh, I'm so mad. We're just watching this one on YouTube. This is where you save all of the girls. This one's got a little crutch. Look at her climbing the ladder like a champ. Wow. That was out of nowhere. Yeah, like I said, I don't know how you're supposed to pull it off. Because you need to use the board to save the girl that could be hacked to get by the saw. But then if it's broken, you can't get it back. So, I don't know. Plus, every time you want to get one of these endings, you have to repeat it. It sucks. Pretty sure the only ending left is the true one. And this is the true ending where we save everyone but the evil girl. This playthrough was by Mrs. Walkthrough, which is the only way I figured out how to do anything in this game beyond the first video. Are these security cameras? I guess you keep playing after that. You can go to the B1 floor? Old dress. What on earth is going on? I already took this poor girl's eye. Is this her house? Is that her mom? There's a grave. Is she like pregnant and her husband died? And that's close for the baby? And the flower just blew away? I'm still very confused as to what's happening. The doll looks like the ghost girl. There's the woman and the girl, and I think she's eating. Who's the girl? Okay, so these are the girls from the game that we see, and the woman. Who they found unconscious or something? What the heck is happening? Is 
Can I like break into the house and do bad stuff? That's still a little vague. But I think maybe those were villains? So, apparently there's like sequels and prequels to this game, which we may check out, that will go deeper into the lore, but apparently that zombie was the blue-haired lady. I guess that's kind of obvious in hindsight. And this girl is the doll who wanted to get revenge for the murder. But... I mean, it's an interesting story, but the game itself, I think, is a little too complicated, and it could have really benefited from a save feature. But let me know what you think in the comments. Did you enjoy this at all? Do you want to see the sequels and prequels? Anyway, thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye!